here, this is Pokeball35, and welcome back to the unboxing of Isaac. Uh, this is a monthly subscription box thing that Edmund McMillan was doing to shove Isaac merchandise in a box. I have the November box here. Uh, this came in today. It is the 4th of November, but my tracking said it was going to come on the 7th of November, so I have this three days earlier than I feel like I'm supposed to. Uh, I actually just finished streaming some Isaac today for the first time in a while, uh, because a brand new, or a, an existing mod for Afterbirth Plus called Revelations got updated to Repentance today, uh, but also Isaac itself updated today with new patches and stuff, so I just streamed Isaac for like four and a half hours, and then I said at the end of the stream, because I got this at the start of the stream, and I was like, hey, I'll open this at the end, and I just ended stream, and I forgot, so we're gonna open this now. Uh, I don't typically look at the, like, the, the promotional streams or something uh, to see what's in the box, because I know I'm probably going to like what's, whatever's in here anyway. Uh, I'm, you know, wearing one of the previous Isaac shirts today. So, like, I, I like all of these. Uh, but the thing on here says, uh, November uh, Binding Pale Kid 2022. All right, well, I have a thumbtack that I cut these open with and stuff. Uh, if you're interested in seeing me uh, play more Isaac, please consider subscribing to the YouTube channel if you have not done so already, because I have like a playlist of like over 200 Isaac videos on the channel. Uh, and if you want to see me play Isaac live, I am live almost every single day at twitch.tv slash pokeball35, link in the description down below. So let's get this open. So here is our inside. We have our notes. Uh, the note feels like it's on different a different piece of paper this time around. Typically, they're like kind of like harder pieces of paper. This one does not feel like that. Uh, but I will quickly do this so it focuses in a little bit more, and you can see the whole note almost. I gotta hold it. A little bit differently this time. Uh, so I just want you to be able to see what this says, and you can pause it and read it, but I'm going to read it out loud. So, it reads, when I was uh, set, uh, five seven or 527, garbage pail kids ruined my life. There was a little corner market two blocks from my dad's house, and every weekend my sister and I stayed with him. Uh, I would always get a GPK pack, or Garbage Garbage Pill Kids pack, uh, by the far, uh, by far the biggest highlight of the weekend. By the time I was seven, I had totally covered my dresser with Garbage Pill Kids stickers. I loved how it looked, and was completely devastated when a few years later, uh, that dresser would become damaged in a move and had to be thrown away. My whole Garbage Pill Kid uh, collection was gone! Even though Garbage Pail Kids were just a satirical riff on Cabbage Patch Kids, they felt like completely like their they felt completely like their own thing. And if you ask me, uh, what one thing was uh, one thing has influenced my work the most, I still uh, uh, it a hundred percent has to be the Garbage Pail Kids series. I even went and saw the movie in theaters the day it came out, and I, and still think it's one of the most fun movies ever made. So for this month's shirt, I actually reached out to Tom Bunk, one of the OG artists for Garbage Pail Kids, as well uh, as Bad Magazine, another major influence on me, to do the art. Uh, and he did such an amazing job. Totally surreal to see this thing happen. Anyway, I'm sorry this wasn't a funny note, but everything else I wrote about that time in my life was far too depressing uh, to send to thousands of people in a box of fun stuff. But I'll leave you with a joke. What type of poop should you never crack the corny ones from Edmund. And then the art on there. So, that's a really interesting detail. Um, get rid of the plastic, I'll throw it out later. There's a bunch of stuff in here. Uh, so, first I will open the, because this is just on top, uh, the Four Souls special cards. Let me get this on open, and get this out of the card sleeve. So for the Four Souls cards, 
there is number one. Uh, there is... <laughs> wouldn't you guess what's next? Number two. Uh, and... There is... Butt Penny. As well as a different kind of car. We haven't gotten one of the one like this before. Uh, Black Market. It's like a sideways card. It's got the Keeper and a bunch of mystery items on it. That's really cool. I enjoyed that. Uh, st I believe at some point this month, uh, the month of November, is when all the Isaac merchandise I, I bought from the post-Kickstarter sale from when the Four Souls expansion happened. Uh, because I had bought, like, at the time, like, $400 worth of Isaac merch. Like, I think, like, two shirts, because I didn't have any Isaac shirts at the time, and I didn't know this whole thing was happening at the time. And I bought, like, an entire series of Isaac figures and a baby plum plushie. <laughs> And all, and plus the entire Four Souls collection. So, eventually that'll be coming to my house. Uh, the next thing in here, this is really cool. The Binding of Isaac, Evil Eve. It's Garbage Pill Kids art. This looks really good. Well, I like. I can always forget to make things for the thumbnails. I'll try and make a face for the thumbnail this time. Uh, there's that exact art on, uh, the postcard for the creator. Uh, with the signature of the creator of Garbage Pill Kids. Uh, there is... <laughs> I want to use this, actually. It is a... Duke of Flies air freshener. I don't know what the Duke of Flies would smell like, but I don't think I want to smell the Duke of Flies. Like, ever? Uh, but that is the end of the box with the shirt, so I'm assuming the shirt also has, you know, the same thing on it being the Garbage Pail Kids art. So, here we go. Yep. Uh, I feel like this is the one shirt that I, like, wouldn't wear outside. <laughs> but, like, I was trying to, like, get a, a thing here. Actually, I, I might need it on, like, this side. I'm gonna put the shirt on anyway. Hold on, I'll be right back. Hey, you know what? With the power of editing, I can just still sit in my chair and take my shirt off, and you won't know. Uh, but, The Binding of Isaac, Evil Eve. I'm gonna have this... Yeah, I'm actually gonna take the uh, air freshener out of the bag. There's, like, tears in it. All right, we're gonna smell this. I'm gonna scratch it just in case. Um... Sit down first, but... To me, it smells like old wood. Is this inspired by the dresser that Edmund had? <laughs> Where the, we had the he had the wooden dresser with all the Garbage Pill Kids stickers on it? I don't really know what this smells like. But to me, it's, it, it, it's, it smells like an old wooden dresser. <laughs> and to me, that's what it smells like. Uh, let me get this here and I'm gonna you know have I'll have the the dupe being held and then I'll get the uh, the the, uh, the postcard and I'll do something like that's a thumbnail face if I've ever seen one something like that either way that is the November box for the unboxing of Isaac if you are interested in continuing or if you want to get uh, the next unboxing of Isaac Box, uh, link in the description to Edmund's Twitter where you can find out more about that. Uh, I don't know if you can buy the previous month boxes. I still really haven't looked into that because I have all of these. Uh, but, uh, I subscribed during the first month of this, so there's normally 12 boxes, but there's gonna be a 13th by the end of this whole thing. So I get, like, a special exclusive box that I will also be unboxing. So, if you want to see more unboxing of Isaac from me, I have the playlist. You can see all the previous month's worth of Unboxing of Isaac. If you want to see more Binding of Isaac from me, like I had said at the start, I have a whole playlist. Uh, I stream a lot of Isaac, so you can check that out uh, as, or, and stuff. Uh, from uh, Revelations that I had just played today, uh, I'm going to try and have this as a late upload today for uh, Friday the 4th. So tomorrow, uh, the 5th, Saturday, uh, there should be a Isaac highlight coming out. Uh, from the incredibly insane 
hour plus long a run I had of one of the uh, Revelations characters. Uh, so if you want to check that out, you can. Uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel if you've not done so already. I do have a lot to offer, including Isaac and all the other stuff that I played that Edmund's made, and all the other full game players I have up on my channel. And uh, please uh, subscribe. Yeah, subscribe to the YouTube channel and follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash pokeball 35 Link in the description down below. That is all I have to say about this. One more look at, you know, the cool art and stuff. And I will see you with the next box.